Hey guys, uh, Tasha here, and I have another update video. It's not that big of one like the last one. Uh, it's pretty short. Um, and also, a uh, little warning, if you hear like banging in the background, um, that's Derek practicing his um, drum, like the electric drums he has. Um, and so yeah, there's like a lot of banging, but no actual music coming out because he has it in through his earphone. But anyways, um, yeah, so I'm doing the front facing camera so I can actually see what's going on and not guess about where I'm like positioning stuff. So if the quality is a little eh, that's why. Um, I mean, and it may be the same. I don't know. I won't know until I go over everything and edit it and upload it. Um, but I can tell that you have a little bit of better uh, view of my background and I finally put up the Star Wars poster and I'm like totally in love with it. It's from the original and it just, it just looks really retro and not like the newer ones that just have more, I get I don't know how to explain it, but anyways, I love it regardless. And I think I paid like six bucks for it on Amazon. So <laughs> anyways, <laughs> let's get to the update. Um, so these all came from the 788 Walmart Blu-ray bin. Uh, and I only got like five. Yeah, five. Um, I don't think, yeah, I think that was it. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get started. Uh, the first one I got is Stargate. Let's see if I can, there's like really bad glare. But yeah, Stargate, and this one was $5, uh, which is not a bad deal. And I can't remember though, if this is the one that has like a really crappy transfer, because I know they did like two different versions um, on Blu-ray. And I haven't even opened it yet, so I'm not entirely certain, but there's um, a good bit of special features on it. So that's that's really cool. Uh, next one I got was the Friday the 13th remake, the killer cut. Um, and then, uh-oh. Oh, no, I think that's like the middle thing. It sounded like there was a disc loose, but there's not. Um, and it's got okay special features. Um, I actually enjoy this one, uh, if only for uh, Jared Padalecki, because I'm a big Supernatural fan, so of course. Um, and Derek had never seen this until I think I showed it to him last year, and he actually loved it too. Um, so, meh. Um, third one, we got a Giant Mnemonic, and I used to watch this all the time. I loved it, and I, I haven't watched it in about four years, I want to say, so I'm excited to, to get to watch it again, because Keanu Reeves is awesome, and he he is like, he's on my hall pass list, so if I have like a hall pass, um, he, he would be one of the men that I would choose if that were ever in the realm of possibility, so yeah. Uh, next one, I was surprised that this was in the 788 bin, uh, but kind of not, given the rumors that I heard that it wasn't that great of a release, especially coming from Screen Factory, so that was a little odd. Um, but yeah, Mad Max, the Screen Factory edition, and it has the slipcase, so that's pretty awesome. Uh, I have never seen this one. I have never seen Road Warrior. I've only ever seen Thunderdome and Fury Road. And yeah, I wait, I think, are those the only ones? I'm not sure. But yeah, I've never seen this one, so I'm eager to watch it. Um, and it's got some, it got some decent special features. Oh, Giant Mnemonic has no special features, by the by. So, yeah. But, um, yeah, like I said, highly surprised to see that for $7.88, but... And then the last one I got was Dark City. And it's been over 10, I think, hold on, what year did this come out? I don't know. I think it's been about 10 years since I've watched this one. Um, almost. Because I remember I watched it when I visited um, Rachel in New Hampshire ages ago. And I remember I stayed at her place and we watched it. I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. But it's got Jennifer Conley in it, and I love her. She's always, like, an amazing actress, so 
it'll be nice to revisit this and it's it's got some good special features so yeah, that's uh all the ones i got for this week and i'm not sure i'm not sure if i'm gonna get any more that might change but right now i'm gonna kind of slow down because i did get a bit uh like a, not a bit much but i got a lot and I'm, i want to try and like actually watch these versus letting them sit on the shelf for ever and ever until i actually uh to actually watch them so yeah like I, I put all of my horror like all of my good releases up here in the office and eventually um i might get a tv for in here so that i can watch it we have a tv in our bedroom and i told derek that i might you know go in there and watch a few horror movies to do reviews on occasionally like if he's downstairs watching something i really don't care to watch um, but I don't know so far that's not happened. Um, and I've been mostly focusing on my Etsy shop. So I don't know. We'll see. I'll hopefully get reviews back up on the channel at some point. And these, my bangs are terrible. I don't think the lady who cut my bangs did a very good job because they're, I feel like they're super thin and like there's this piece that never wants to, uh, fill in. So it looks like really odd. But yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching and I will catch you guys on the next video, which will hopefully be soon. And I've already got one planned. I just got to actually sit down and film it. So until then, bye.